I pitched at the beginning of the year what journey we're going to take the guests on during that year in the conservatory. When the idea of that journey is approved, then we start doing illustrations that represent what that journey looks and feels like. We kind of dial it in more and he presents renderings and different ideas of what that could look like. And we keep going back and revising that with um, all levels at the at the Bellagio and everyone gets to take a look at it and when it finally is blessed and we say we love it, this is what should be inside the conservatory, we go to work and ideally that would be about a year out. The hard part is, and the trickiest part, is always to take those illustrations and make them a reality, but we have the most unbelievable builders that we work with here at Bellagio that can take those dreams and make them a reality. Everything you would see in that rendering, we break it down and we have very detailed discussions with the designer about what would this look like? What would this feel like? What's the texture like of this? Just basically how we're gonna paint with texture and color through botanical materials. As you go through, you'll see that some of the balloons are made out of ground shells and seeds and blue things that look like other blue things. So it's like really using nature and making that, translating that nature as part of our palette. This is our production schedule and timeline. This is really my Bible. This tells me um, this takes a lot of work to put together. I work with every single fabricator, electrician, plumber, and say, how long does it take? When can you do it? As we start to pencil them in, we move them around, and that's how we build um, all the way from really the Tuesday prior to starting. But the hard schedule starts on Sunday and rolls all the way through Friday. Every hour we work around the clock, three shifts, um, so 24 hours a day for six days, starting Sunday at midnight, all the way through till Friday. We try to open at 5 p.m. On Sunday and Monday, we empty the room out completely. And then on Tuesday and part of Wednesday, we would build West Bed and South Bed. And then the rest of Wednesday and Thursday, we build East Bed and North Bed. This is what we're trying to get to today. And as we work through, I'll start adding things to Wednesday morning. Watch your step on the willow tree that is yet to come together. And then over here, we are almost done the, the hard build of our self bed. So a lot of the structure is going to be in place. What comes after this is so water, water features, and of course, the star of the show, all the plant material. They built the structure yesterday, and now all the amazing art and scenic departments come in and do their magic to make all the details come to life. We are very on schedule right now. I hate saying that out loud. Because <laughs> you know, I, I, as soon as I say that, that is exactly when we veer off schedule. But no, if we get to everything on the board, we're a full day ahead. But don't tell anybody out there, because then they'll... <laughs> Our horticulture team on property takes care of the exhibit, installs it, takes care of all of the plant material that we use. Um, they are full time, um, but we work with growers around the country um, and all of the things that you see inside the conservatory, they're massive quantities of things. So not everyone is ordering you know, 40,000 tulips in a certain color. So we work with them and they grow specifically what we need um, and it is born to live inside the conservatory.